Hey y'all, how you doing? Wilhelmina here with Wall Decor by Faye. I hope y'all are having a good day. It's um, rainy and nasty here in Virginia. I'm in Norfolk, Virginia. But that's okay, it's a perfect day to sit here and craft. I was out all morning this morning and um, did a little live at Walmart. Decided to say hi and chat with y'all. I hadn't chatted since, I guess, what, Tuesday evening? Or afternoon-ish, however you want to call it. <laughs> Depending on where you are, I guess. After an evening? Yes. Um, and, hey, okay, bye. Or oh, Velia, Velia, and D in Brooklyn. How y'all doing? I appreciate y'all coming in and saying hi. Um, I figured we'd do a little painting today. Um, painting, always, I always like to paint and, uh, on these nasty rainy days. It just, you know, it just lets, it helps time go by. And then I don't think about snacking all day, too. So I had this, I got this. Snacking all day. <laughs> I got this at um, Joann's. I went this Brooklyn last week. From New Jersey. Hey, Brooklyn from New Jersey. If y'all are new, let us know um, yeah, where you're from. And um, please, I guess, like and Straight share and up. follow and all that stuff. <laughs> like love, um, this I got at Joann's last week. I think I went on Thursday. And um, it was 70% off. It looked like this. It had this. You know, just the regular old, I guess it's particle board or plywood or something. I don't know. Um, and it was it was 20 bucks originally, but um, it was 70% off. So I'm like, what the heck? And um, That's a big price for a project. we've been having issues with keeping a wreath on our door because the birds and the wasps and all that. Uh, birds like to birds yeah, we didn't really have that problem at our last place, but this place it's really bad. So um, I figured, well, I'll paint this for the door, and then I don't have to worry. And then I have something nice on the door. So when I was painting this all white, I'm like, oh my gosh, how am I going to do this? <laughs> um, am I going to paint the letters first and then the background? background first, then the letters. See, I'm not really a painter, I'm a wreath maker, so I was like, oh gosh. When I went to Walmart this morning, I bought tons of paint. Well, I've been on a paint buying spree the last few days. A Hobby Lobby had paint on sale this last week, so I was buying it from Hobby Lobby. Um, I couldn't find it in Joann's fast enough because I was in a hurry, so I didn't go looking in there very long. So I figured, well, you know what I'm going to do? I have some napkins. I figured what I'm going to do is today we'll paint the letters and the flower. And then we'll let it dry. And then I'm going to attempt, keyword attempt, um, I think I'll paint this edge black. And then I'm going to attempt to um, Mod Podge this on to the background. And those are my thoughts for now. You know how that goes. Oh, um, so I bought a bunch of paint brushes and little sponges and all that stuff this morning when I was in um, Walmart. And yeah, just a whole bunch of stuff. You know, just little odds and ends. I like going to Walmart early, early Sunday morning because there's nobody in there. So what else do we get? Oh, I got some more. I found some more sponges. Because this is what I went in there looking for originally. Faith. And, um... Faith says hi, Olivia and Steve. Hi, Faith. Hi, Faith. How, How you, are you doing? How you doing? <laughs> Look at this, um, glitter. Isn't it beautiful? I bought some glitter because, you know, glittery. girls always love glitter. But I'm like... <laughs> and I'm a pink girl. Pink, pink, pink. Um, and then, look at... When I got home... <laughs> I evidently liked it last time I was there, too, because ah, I have it. The same one? Yeah. I think they're the same. Well, one looks a hair darker, but I don't think so. This says cameo pink. Yeah, no, they're both cameo pink. So, I've got tons of pink, y'all. <laughs> so, you know we're going to be doing lots of projects in pink. I um, am kind of on a painting kick, and last year I had bought... 
a whole case of mason jars because I was determined I was going to paint mason jars and do this and that. So that's what I'm going to do. I have the case sitting in my bedroom. I don't know if y'all do that, but it's, it's, it's been sitting there for a year. It says she's good, and you are enjoying this holiday weekend and finally good. up on so much to Good, good, good. See, I bought more paint. I'm glad to hear that. Um, yeah, it was stormy, stormy here yesterday, and I don't know if you saw my life from earlier. See, lots of paint. Um, I... I, I'm having some test work done, you know, at the doctor's. So I had to spend the day kind of pretty much at home yesterday because I, every time I had to go potty, I had to save it and then bring it to the doctor today. So that's, that, you know, one. that's always fun. So, um, number one, number yes, one. number one. <laughs> so that was, yeah, that's how I've been going. And look, I decided I wanted to try something else new. I'm telling y'all, my, my brain just doesn't stop. Um, I saw a video and someone made these snow cones. Are these called snow cones? These are snow cones, right? So, yeah, snow cones. I'm like, I can do that. And I have tons of styrofoam balls. And as you can see, tons of yarn, the chunky yarn. So, um, look, I made some snow cones. And these will be going into my Etsy boutique as well. And, um... I thought it turned out pretty cute. I'm thinking of to putting a bow, a little bow on it. I have, oh, here we go. I, I was looking through my Christmas stash and I saw, I thought I had more, you know, a whole bunch of different kinds of bows, but I, evidently I must have used them. But I was thinking, you know, cut this off, of course, and put a little bow on it. And I thought that would be cute. So what do y'all think? So these will be, um, I started working on them just the other day. So I figured I'm, I'm going to make them in like pink, of course, pink, you know, and, um, any other colors I can think of. I have a, like a really neon green. I thought that would look cool too. So those are just some of the things, <laughs> um, I did, like I I don't know if I said already, but, um, Y'all, I had a coffee, one of those triple shot coffees, so mm, bear with me. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, I bought a sewing machine, so I'm going to try try my hand at sewing, too. You know, I'm going to be well-rounded. Um, but anyway, let's get on. I'm trying to choose. I'm looking at this um, napkin, and this is what I have in mind. I also have some um, Mackenzie Child napkin, too, but I didn't. I think I like this better. It looks a little more summery. I figured this will be good out in the summertime. So this is this is where I'm gonna stick my head, stick my mind at. Um, I'm trying to think of the colors for the flowers. That looks pretty. I think I like that with it. But you know, I love my pink. But because I was thinking of doing the welcome in blue. So, so Hello, Arnetta. How are you? We're going to do a little painting today. And then uh, and then either later today or tomorrow, we'll finish up. I'm thinking of Mod Podging this on the background. Those are my thoughts. So I was thinking of, I'm going to do the, the, the letters in blue. So that's what I'm going to do. And then the flower, I know I want to use this color because I think that looks good together. And it'll look good with this. So I think I like this blue better than this. This is a Royal Navy and this is called Royal Blue. But they're so different. Look at that. They're very different. Um, but I'm thinking, I think I like this because I think it looks kind of picnic-y, if that's a word. So I'm trying to think of colors that'll go good with this red background. <laughs> yeah, so I'm thinking, I think I want to put the center, I want the center of the flower to be this pink. That's, because I don't want too much pink in here. So I'm going to do the center of the flower pink, and I'm going to do the outer rim of these, this color. And I think, 
yes I think I'm gonna do this little thing this color that okay that's where I'm going <laughs> so that's okay that's where we're going and I like no I like this blue better okay okay so I'm gonna start with the center I'll start with the easiest part so first so what are y'all doing and what's the weather like where you are I rainy. need to know all the things. It's rainy and cloudy here. It's, yeah, more than cloudy. It is dark. It looks like it's nighttime here. Well, not nighttime, actually, but That's like, it. you know, really late in the afternoon. That's what it looks like here. Dusty. Yeah, but it's icky, icky, icky outside. So Steve didn't have to clean the car. Oh, thanks. Yeah, I've had this for a while, and I, I came across it the other day. I'm like, oh, I'm going to wear my mini. I love me some mini. So I'm going to paint this. i got to get a little. I'm glad I bought these. It's got a wide range of sizes of paintbrushes, and I, I think it was like only five bucks. Hi, Pat. Pat says hi. Hello, Pat. How are you? And also love the shirt, but you got that one. Right? Yeah. So I have another receipt here for, I don't know what, I think seashells. Oh, y'all, because that's what I'm getting into now, too. I'm going to be painting other things. going to be painting other things. So I think I'll use, I don't want to use too small of a paintbrush, because otherwise we'll be here all day. But this is just for the, uh, oops, for the center right here. You know what, Stephen, can you get me a little cup with water? I, don't, I didn't think about that. Thank you. I love, love, love this pink. I didn't need that much, but I love it. So are y'all going to cook out tomorrow? We bought, we went to um, Trader Joe's. I don't know if everybody has a Trader Joe's. But they have the best um, carne and pollo asada. Oh, my goodness. So we bought some of that, and Steve's going to grill. And then I bought some avocados because I make the bomb um, guacamole. Is it to yes. Fun? Thank you. I make, uh, not to toot my own horn, but I'm tooting my own horn. <laughs> I make good, good guacamole. So that's what I'm going to do tomorrow. So we're ha And then we've got some corn on the cob. So I guess Steve will grill the corn on the cob. And it's just him and I and our son, who's 23, so he'll probably be hanging out with his friends. You and Pokemon. Yeah. Well, we didn't have to say all that. <laughs> but, um, yeah. So, you know, I don't, I, I don't, we're not going to do the beach or anything. I don't even know what the weather is going to be like here tomorrow. And, y'all, when you're painting, be sure you have the baby wipes. <laughs> yes. Baby wipes come in handy. Very, very handy. There we go. So is anybody going to the beach? Y'all gonna... Um, Virginia has lifted the mandatory mask if you... Um, do you have a dry paper towel too? Sorry. Are there by you on the right? Okay, okay. Um, if you're fully vaccinated, so I think I think it might be a little crowded in Virginia Beach. That's the beach that's closest to us um, tomorrow. So I I I know we're not going to go to the beach. I'm going to let that center part dry because it's. Uh, it's on there kind of funny. It's not like a solid on there. So I'm going to let it dry before I do another coat. And then now I'm going to do these. And then I'll do that one. Yeah. So y'all, what are you doing? What are you doing today? Are you making any crafts? You um, Are you wreath makers? Are you... Um, embellishment makers what's going on talk to me y'all i know i shouldn't do that with my teeth 
Yeah, use the end of your um. Well, I got it off already. Ball. You need to open another one. Oh yeah. Uh, I have my my um, little. You need a knife. I use my. No, I have that little. Whatever I. Edge thingy. Exacto. Whatever I forget to call it. Exacto. Exacto. Yeah. Exacto. <laughs> see this one. See these aren't the best brushes, which I knew they wouldn't be. I mean, what do you want for? I think it was like five or seven bucks for this whole thing, but I'm not, you know, like I said, I'm not a real painter. I just, uh, I just dabble. Just dabbling. This one is a little angled, so I think this will work good. Painting this thing white took me a lot longer than I thought it would. Getting in all these little grooves. That's in Maryland. I was, um, She's you. oh, okay. I, um, just watched a, like a one season series called Halston. I love watching about fashion designers and stuff like that. So, you know, of course this was a biography and, um, it's still going on, isn't it? no, it's over. Yeah. It was just a one season thing. I think like five or six episodes. You didn't see the end. <laughs> he, um, yeah, he died like in 1990. I didn't know so long ago. But yeah, you know, just like the typical 80s story. Um, New York and uh, they didn't say all that. But, um, you know, he had. HIV and all that stuff. Partying too much. But had an exciting life. I think that would be cool. Being a um, fashion designer. I always wanted, when growing up, I wanted to be an interior decorator. But I guess... This is this well. This is kind of interior design, isn't it? Yes, it is. Interior and exterior. Definitely. Wreath making and. Not everybody puts the wreath on the. Inside. inside. I mean outside. And outside. Inside. <laughs> inside, outside. Well, I'm making centerpieces and all that stuff. One of those sides. Huh? Are y'all getting ready? F are you still doing patriotic or um, you starting on fall? I know for my shop, I started fall already, but um, locally, I'm still doing, you know, patriotic and summertime. So it gets a little, it's a little uh, crowded in the house as far as um, supplies. Yeah, and I'm a little shaky <laughs> from all that coffee you drank this morning. No. Yes. Oh uh, no. So we we have this thing out here called the. Is it the light rail or just the oh the tide or something? That's light rail. It's um. It's. It's like a trolley. Yeah, kind of like a trolley, but it it goes really fast. A bus on bus on train track. Yeah, and um, we were thinking of going on that today from the beginning to the end, but it's so nasty outside, and it's actually kind of cold. It's only in the sixties here, and That's if you know me, tonight. I'm always cold. Let's have church tonight. Yeah, we have church tonight. We don't have time to do it now. So. Unless it unless it goes to church. <laughs> well, we, you know, this is a military town, so we were thinking it would go from the base to the ocean front, which would make sense, but they stopped like halfway, and it doesn't even go to the base, so I don't know. It's supposed to be, you know, be a convenience thing. Yeah, it's one of those things that they spent like too much money and got like too little fall for their investment. But it, it does help because I know, like, my son just got a job at Waterside, you know, at, at a hotel, so he can ride the, oh, yeah. the rail instead of taking his car and then paying for downtown parking. So, yeah. 
Because, you know, parking, yeah. parking will kill you. That's a good idea. Well, he was the one who told me about it. They don't charge parking for the employees except at the oh. Look at it, I made a, a boo-boo. Yeah, I was gonna, I wanted to do a um, wreath, but then I saw this in the back of my car. I forgot I had gotten it, honestly. And um, I'm like, well, I need something for my door. I really do. And I just thought this would be, you know, something different. And I'll save the um, the wreath for Tuesday, to my usual Tuesdays live. And I just thought this would add a little bit of sunshine to this gloomy day. It's so gloomy. I don't like, you know what, if it's raining and like a thunderstorm, I don't seem to mind it as much. But when it's just gloomy, because it's not even really raining right now, is it? But, yeah. That's a Mexican guy. I don't know. It's just icky out. Just icky. You can't wash the car. Oh, poo poo. Change the oil. <laughs> I mean, I don't know why I'm worried about the background that much because I'm going to try to decoupage it. But. And y'all, um, Steve and I worked on a bunch of signs yesterday. So I'll have some more signs to show you. that I, I just took pictures of before we came live. I was wanting to, you know, list them and all that. Uh, two of them I have listed, but the rest I don't, so. We'll show you some new signs. I try to show them on, on my Facebook business page, Wall Decor by Faye, and I also have a YouTube channel, so if you haven't checked out my YouTube channel, I'd love it if you'd like and subscribe to that. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers so I can go live on on my YouTube channel. Well, I will post the link right now. And who knows? Maybe I'll find some little, some other little flowers or something to put on here, or maybe I'll get wild. And I've been trying to watch some um, YouTube videos on how to paint flowers by hand. Yeah, so do y'all, do any of y'all paint? Hey, Jojo, how you doing? Hello, hello. <laughs> Thanks for coming in and saying hi. Y'all, yes, nice. please sprinkle the love. I need to get some more viewers on here. <laughs> very nice We're just doing you. a little painting today. Trying to bring some sunshine into this gloomy, gloomy Norfolk. I wonder if it's cold up in Massachusetts today. I think she you were you were live yesterday, right, Jojo? I think she was at an antique show, or was that the other day? Um, and it looked kind of um, icky up there too. But I've heard like the whole East Coast is kind of poopy this weekend. Mm. It doesn't feel like almost June, that's for sure. That was a Tuesday you were supposed. To... Tuesday is yeah. And Tuesday is our wedding anniversary. Uh -oh. We will have been married 24 years. Oh, tell me. <laughs> uh, 24 beautiful years. 24 years. Definitely 24. 25 or 24. <laughs> How we were married 24 years and I'm only 29. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I think we're going to get in trouble. <laughs> I uh, know. Probably, <laughs> Probably me. Probably you, yes. <laughs> and my son swears he's 23, so I don't know how all this math works. Good thing I'm a designer. Yeah. That's a good thing. Well, thank you, Jojo. Appreciate it. <laughs> So yeah, we're just gonna um, paint the lettering and the flowers, and then um, 
I'm going to decoupage or mod podge, whatever you want to call it, um, this on the background. So I thought that would look cute. Uh, Miss Jojo's doing a live sale tonight, tons of beast Yes. Did she go down into the basement? Yes, she did. Yeah, I saw your post. I said yes. Um, but you know we go to church at 7. Oh, we have to be there at 7. So I'll be able to watch some of it. I don't want to buy too much because you know, um, I know you, I saw you there on Tuesday on Ribbon to Bows. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. We bought some ribbons to make some pretty bows. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. No, never have enough ribbon. That's why I try not to go on that page. <laughs> But it's all designer ribbon yeah. at cheaper cost. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. Hello, Darlene. How are you? We're painting. Painting, painting. I hope you're not seeing too much of the top of my head. I'm trying to get these edges without, I don't know why I'm worried about the the background, but I don't want to get the top of this flower either because I want to do that another color. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> they had a lot of cutie, cutie stuff this time. I was on there once before and I only, I was so good. I only bought one roll of ribbon. Don't know how I did it, but I did. I think probably because I said, okay, I got to leave. <laughs> and I just left early. But you know, I had to put my bright colors in here. Love me some bright colors. <clears throat> thank you, thank you. I hope he does. I know he will. I know he will. He always does. God is good. That was awesome. Sorry, I had, can't talk and <laughs> get in those tiny spots at the same time. <laughs> oh, good. They, I'm so glad, Jean. You're welcome. I told you as soon as I found out, I'd let you know. That's Yay. Nice, uh, she knows what she's doing. Who? Well, makes the hot dogs and oh, Kim. Kim Horstman. Yeah, she makes some good, good stuff. Good stuff, man. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. <laughs> but yeah, this is very cathartic. And then with these lights on, I feel like I'm at, I feel like it's sunny. With these pretty colors and the lights all on. I just won't look outside. Because I have the window right there. <laughs> So just uh, putting a second coat on the outer petals and trying to get this edge. I guess it really doesn't matter if I get the the base. And if it did, I mean, I could always paint over white, so I don't need to be so detailed. So y'all yeah, talk to me. Talk to me, otherwise I'm talking to myself. I think the flower will take the longest. Yeah, the lettering should go just right. easy peasy. I do want an outline at all or on the letter on the flower or an outline? I don't know. I'm just, I don't know. No, because I'm gonna decoupage the napkin on, on the background, so no. Well, That's two, my thought process. Yeah, because anyway. yeah. Yeah, we'll have to let this dry and and, uh, yeah, I'm sure y'all don't want to sit here and watch paint dry. Why not? <laughs> so this is looking pretty. It is looking very nice. 
Do y'all have something on your door? Let me know what you have on your doors. I know a lot of wreath makers don't usually have stuff on their doors. Just like mechanics don't work on their own cars and, you know, <laughs> you know how that goes. Oh, I was watch. I was also. Bleh, bleh, I was also watching um, that British British baking show before I came live. <laughs> Do y'all ever watch that? The British baking show. Look, it's funny. Them. Well, at, at the holidays they have like a bake off. Well, I guess it is a bake off. Yeah, it's a long, quite a long little. They go through a lot of. Uh, things they gotta bake but it's it's kind of funny and they make stuff I've never heard of like oh my goodness now I can't see this other side of this so if I don't get the whole the back side of these petals otherwise you'll all be looking at my roots Roots are made for walking. <laughs> You're such a dork. <laughs> oh, but I love you. <laughs> See, I'm not worried. Okay, I'm not worried about the the um the base because I'm just gonna be covering that up. Yeah, and as you know, I have a um. I already have picked out what I'm going to make on Tuesday. And it will be a wreath, so. But tomorrow I think, you know, I'm going to finish this up. So I want to do the, see if this center is dry enough for me to do a second coat on before I paint the, the other set of petals. So do y'all like to paint? What do y'all like to do other than, you know, what you usually do? I don't know if all y'all are wreath makers or um, whatever. Talk to me. Inquiring minds want to know. Everybody's way too quiet. I know. You got to be working on something. Are y'all going to be barbecuing tomorrow, or what are you going to do? I think I got some pink up there. That's okay. Maybe it'll blend in with the color that I put on top. Because that... I'm still not happy with the way that center looks. But we'll see. We will see. I know, I do have a wreath kit, too. That I'd like to make and show y'all. Because um, I want to use one of the hamburgers and hot dogs in it too. But do y'all want to see some of the new signs that we made? Yeah. Okay. I have. Now these first two that I'm fixing to show you. They are in um, listed already. So I think this is the last um, patriotic one that we're going to make and put in the shop for this year. And it comes just in the eight inch square. Nice little denim background, isn't that? Because of the braid. Yes. Awesome. Okay. Yes, and us being in the military town, it particularly rings true. A lot of people across the country have um, family, you know, siblings uh, yeah. in the military, so. Even though we're in a military town, like military oh, yeah, there's yeah, everywhere. Everywhere. And this, I love, love, love this one. This is a nice um, fall one. A nice rustic fall one. I, I just it's love this one. Thankful, thankful, blessed. Yeah. Well, it's not backwards on this camera, so they can. No, I'm just reading it. Okay. Isn't it cool? I love, love, love this one. I think this is like one of my favorite fall ones that we've made. 
I know. I love it. I love it. And this is this one right here is an 8x10, but it comes in a 7x9 as well. Love it. Y'all, I was working on my tan, and now it's going to start fading. Oh I know. <laughs> 57, and I'm still worried about it. <laughs> You said you were 29. Uh, oh, yeah, that's what I meant. 29. Gracious, yeah, that's the right? ticket. <laughs> Make up your mind. And here's another fall one. And this is great. And then this is an 8 inch round, and it's available in a 12 inch round as well. well yes. This Now, this one is not in the shop yet. The first two were. But I've taken pictures, so I'll be listing these after the live today. But I just thought that was really cool. Friends and family, now that we can start, you know, seeing each other again and doing all that stuff. So that's that's a couple of them for now. Just thought I'd tease you. So Jojo says super cute signs. Thanks. Thank you, Jojo. Thank you, thank nice. you. So now I'm going to do a, a little lighter yellow for this um, this set of petals right here. Oh, I think I like this. And I think this will look really cute with the uh, with the background, the gingham-looking background, yeah. The red and white. Boy, this English. It's hard, I'm telling you. It's a toughie. It is a toughie. So I think this size brush right here, this is that little angled brush. I definitely need to learn a little bit more about painting. I like doing it. It's a lot of, a lot of uh, attention to detail. Yeah, it really is. I still don't like it as much as wreath making though. <laughs> or centerpieces and all that stuff. Do y'all do custom orders? And if so, do you like doing custom orders? Or would you rather just make your own thing and let people buy it that way? <laughs> so this one, I got to be a little more careful with the edge. So it doesn't look like a hot mess. I think it'll be cute once we do the do the background. I think it'll look really cute. I just about the. I can do that without getting it all over the flowers. Though. What do you mean? Um, this is a napkin. So that's how I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna decoupage it on there. <laughs> you don't have to put it. No, I really don't. I'm winging it. Just an idea that's in my head. Who knows if it's going to work or not. We'll find out. We will find out. I like making customs. It's a challenge. That's what JoJo says. Yeah. Yeah. Especially, you know, especially if, like, the custom is out of town or you've never met the person or whatever and they just tell you well I want this and that because um, I someone wants me to make them a garland for Christmas and I've never made a garland yet and I'm kind of nervous but excited too because once I get in you know as long as the budget is unlimited that's what Joseph said. right oh I know the budget yeah that's that's the thing Yeah, when they say, oh, $50, you're like, oh, yeah, right. $50 won't even get you in the door. Not really. It'll get you a flat rate. <laughs> a pancake. Yeah. Pancake for a store door, 50 bucks. There you go. Maybe. A basic one with no ribbon. <laughs> frame and a picture of a bow tape to it. I'm just trying to do these edges, y'all. So have you already gone through the basement, Jojo? 
I've found the stuff that you want to. Jean says, love the signs. Thank you, Jean. Thanks, Jean. Yeah, people are starting to buy uh, Christmas and all that already, so. Figured we better get them out there. I think, you know, we've been doing it for a little over a year now. And we started with fall when we started making signs, so. We've come full circle for a year already. Uh, it's come by fast. I want a wreath that looks like this, but only want to spend $20 yeah. to tell them I'm not your girl. Right, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Hmm, sorry. That that would be Walmart or, um, yeah. Or the, I brought up a ton, still have lots more. Oh, goodness. I'm, yeah, I don't have a basement, so. But yeah, it's tired from carrying all that stuff up. <laughs> poor girl. <laughs> I was thinking about putting a little glitter on here. And I got something black on here. I don't know what it is. There we go. I don't like that center, though. The center, you know what? That's what I think I'll do. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I don't know. You know what? I bought some um, diamond dust too online. Diamond. diamond dust, y'all. Diamond dust. JoJo says she needs a nap. I need a nap too. <laughs> a nap. Well, you've probably been been up all morning doing that, huh? I need to open this because I need to. Uh, Try to get some of this. Oh, I hate this part. I can never open these dang things. Never. Okay. Let me try it. Without hurting myself. <laughs> yeah. What's wrong? I can't get this dang thing open just so I can. That little. That little part right there so I can sprinkle some glitter on it. It doesn't get everywhere. I'm going to put some glitter in that middle because it's really bothering me. And I don't like the way. I got to fill in these little gaps right here. See, that's why I don't know if I could be a painter, y'all. I'm really too anal about stuff. I mean, like, r really anal. About the littlest things. A lot of OCD? Yeah. A lot of OCD. A lot. A lot, a lot. So I'm going to see about... more so I can get it wet so that um, the glitter y'all I'll be so sad if I get glitter all over this whole thing maybe I won't do it <laughs> yeah yeah I think I'll wait I think I'm just gonna like stipple this you know what I mean just kind of go tick tick I know Okay, it's not just me then. Well, I got it open, but it's just trying to get the piece to come off. Oh. If you don't take it off, it's going to keep the glitter from coming off. Because, see, I just wanted this to be a solid pink, but it's kind of being a poop. So, oh well. <laughs> Hello, Mary. <laughs> Thanks for coming in, y'all. Thanks for hanging out. Just thought we'd chat for a while. Now I'm going to go on to the blue, because that blue is going to be easy peasy. And I like this blue. It's called, oh yeah, Royal Blue. And this one was Royal Navy, but it's so much darker. Look at that. Isn't that crazy? Thank you. I found these new drinks, Celsius. They're really good. It's supposed to give you healthy energy, accelerates metabolism, and burns body fat. The best part is they're found alcoholic. Oh, yeah. 
And you're such a silly. So we're going to do the um, lettering. That's what I figured. I'm going to do this in blue. I just, it reminds, it'll remind me of like a, a picnic sort of thing for summertime. You know what I mean? So I did like this one. This one might be, this might take five days. We'll see. This is kind of like a periwinkle. Yeah, this and it's going to take a couple of, I don't know why. Maybe this wasn't a good paint for um, wood. I don't know. But it's like, the white is showing through. Maybe I should have just left the wood woody. <laughs> left the wood woody? Yeah. I know. That's why I started laughing. Yeah. Like, whatever. <laughs> Y'all can tell I'm not. I'm really not a painter. <laughs> Woody. Woody. <laughs> yeah. But I think with a couple of coats, this will look really pretty. I like periwinkle blue. It's not. Is the dry coat oh, dry completely white? Yeah. <laughs> The dry is completely white. We're just a good pair here, aren't we, Wave? Yeah, I mean, <laughs> works out hard today. They are. <laughs> so do y'all like guacamole? And if you like guacamole, do you like cilantro in your gu guacamole? Because I know cilantro is a love-hate thing, and I absolutely love, love, love cilantro. Now, I've heard a lot of people say that it um, smells and tastes like soap to them. I don't, I don't get the soap thing, but I love it. I don't, maybe it's because I grew up around really good, authentic Mexican food. I grew up in San Diego. I'm sure you're going to say something <laughs> I don't even want to know. <laughs> I don't even want to know. Not on live. Not on live. But uh -huh. I'm afterwards. Oh, no. But, y'all, you know, even if I mess this dang thing up, it only cost me five bucks. And That's what I think. And Girl Creations says, yes, I love yes. guacamole and cilantro. Now I want some. I know. Well, I have three avocados, so I'm going to make a big bunch. We found some new tortilla chips that are the bomb. And I found them at the um, Home Goods store. Do y'all ever buy some of their stuff, their food? Jim says hi, Jean and Lily. Hi. Who's Jean? Jean Bunker. Oh, she gets a hi right now. Okay. And she probably doesn't know you. Anyway, That's Steve. Steve's my husband and my moderator. <laughs> And my second child, well, actually my first child. Oh. <laughs> it's kind of looks like blue jeans. <laughs> That's what I was hoping for, so it'll look good with the um, with the napkin on the background. I thought it would look cute. See the second coat? Yes, is doing it. Absolutely. See that second coat? Yeah. I like it a lot. Yes. Don't know why I got really loud all of a sudden. We were all alone. <laughs> were you? <laughs> coffee. <laughs> coffee and my little energy drink. They work though, y'all. They work really good. <laughs> Get lots of stuff done. I really need, I was telling Steve, because we live about, what, maybe five miles from an Ikea? So I was telling Steve I wanted to go to Ikea today because there's this area right over here to my left that um, 
looks like an explosion went off, y'all. And um, it really, I can't find anything anymore. It's just too cluttered. And I want to um, clean that area. That's why I was in, Wal you know, another reason we went to Walmart this morning. I wanted to find some storage, but there's storage Does Walmart selection. Walmart those waters. No, you know where we found, um, I don't know if you have Harris Teeters. Well, ours we got on base. But if you Google Celsius, um, C -E -L -S -I -S. yeah, they, um, they'll tell you where the nearest place you can get it. Cause I think they have it at Kroger's too. I'm not sure, but I know they have it at Harris Teeters and I think maybe GNC, probably GNC. Cause, um, on base in the gas station mini mart, there's a GNC there. And um, that's where we got ours. And they're like just under two bucks a piece. They're dollar seventy nine on base. And they taste really good. They have lots of different flavors, and and they have some that are carbonated and some that are not. Yeah, that's true. So if you can't have you know carbonation. But I think my new favorite is this grape. It kind of tastes like a grape soda. And I'm not a soda drinker. Isn't that weird that you're painting it like that? No. I mean, it's not upside down for the viewers to see. But yeah, no. That would be, really. be weird to me. No, because I'm not really looking at the letters. I'm just looking at the curves <laughs> of what I have to paint. Making sure I don't go over. But I like this blue. This blue is really pretty. Yeah, they, they have like a triple berry and they have a watermelon and berry and an orange. And it's, I don't, I'm not sure if the orange is carbonated. I don't remember. But I know this grape is carbonated, so it's like having a grape soda. Yeah, I one that. Said cola, don't try that one. That one. <laughs> it's not anything like cola. It's nasty. Yeah, I'm not a cola liker, so no, I didn't no, try that no. one. <laughs> not good at all. But I'll take anything that'll help speed up my metabolism. You know what I mean? Over the counter, well, you know what I mean. Not any silly drug or anything, but you know what I mean. And it, cause it gets kind of boring drinking water all the time. Although we drink that water that's called ice. Sparkling ice. Sparkling ice, yes, and it's so good. Mm. It's so good. We you can get it at Costco and all that. Sam's Club. Sam's Club. Club. And uh I'd be freaking 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 freaking. What's wrong? The silly computer's acting all silly. Oh. Uh, see if you try to go over this on a second coat before it's what dry, it jacks it all up. <laughs> what is water called? Water's called. This one is called Celsius. And they're really good. And they come in a lot of flavors, y'all. They even have like a kiwi and melon or something like that. What about the other stuff you drink, the kombucha? Oh well, yeah, have y'all ever tried kombucha? That's good for you, too. You know, now that I hit 29, I'm trying to stay as healthy as I can. <laughs> that big 3 0. <laughs> what are you trying to say? I can't laugh and paint. Don't make me laugh. <laughs> hey now. Oh, I'm sorry. It's game on. Yeah. Oh, poo poo. Oh, that's it. Facebook too. I know. <laughs> I got the edge. But I think I got the edge of the thing, so that's well, okay. That's not the well, and I'm going to go over it with the. So, my thoughts, y'all, if anybody came on late, um, 
I'm going to um, decoupage the, the background with this. So it just looks kind of like, you know, like a picnic table, something. Summery and picnic-y. You know what I mean? Jelly bean. Miss Magoo. Miss Magoo. I am Miss Magoo. I took my glasses off the other day and I was looking through them from far away and I am blind as a bat. Trying to get some of this edge. Kind of looks like blue jean, doesn't it? That one looks like poop until I get a second coat on there. <laughs> See, I'm very impatient. I need instant results. Instant good results, I should say. Good thing LaVon isn't here watching me paint. She'd be like, what are you doing, girl? She's an awesome painter. Just crawl to the Facebook and... Well, Strangle me. <laughs> well, that would be like my mom. My mom was an awesome seamstress. I mean, she did everything she could quilt. She was a seamstress. She did it all. And um, she was teach. you know, she I was in Girl Scouts. And so she was teaching the um, sewing badge. And she told me I should just hang it up. And now, look, I go buy a sewing machine. She's probably in heaven going, oh, my goodness, girl. <laughs> Give it another shot. I was sewing. Yeah, Steve is sewing. Yes, he was. So I'm not just a, another pretty face just sitting around. <laughs> not just another pretty face. He does. He helps me out a lot. He helps make the signs. I design and he does the computer work for it because you know me and computers. I don't know if you um, if you creatives are good with computers, but I'm not. They make me very angry, which is not good. You wouldn't like it when I do it. No. You turn all green. On a good day. Yeah, I don't. They just, and computers just don't like me either. They laugh at me. <laughs> Kim <laughs> says, let me know if you need help with sewing. Okay. There's Kim. Hey, girl. I sure will. So you, be careful because <laughs> you, you open the floodgates now. I'll be calling you all the time. Kim, FaceTime me. But that's okay. I think the older I get, the more I'm willing to learn new things, you know? And step out of my comfort zone. Because if you would have told me 30 years ago that I would be doing any of this and going live, um, I would have laughed in your face. Would you be married with a 23-year-old son? I know. Well, I... I'm really not, I'm an outgoing person, but I really am not good at talking in front of a lot of people. Um, I was a waitress for 30 years, so I knew how to schmooze, but, <laughs> do, you know, doing, I took a public speaking class in high school and failed miserably at it, and I was deathly afraid, and of course, one of the first speeches I had to talk about was premarital sex. I'm like, oh yeah. So that totally turned me off. <laughs> and I was a freshman in high school in a class of seniors. So that was just not good. So I never would in a million years thought I'd be doing a Facebook live. And more than once, y'all kidding me. But I guess this is kind of just like talking to yourself. Which is kind of weird, too. <laughs> so y'all need to talk to me. Ask me anything you want. Why does the sky go blue? What? Why does the sky go blue? What? I could ask you anything I want. Okay. Yeah, so strange. Oh, my word.
Yep. Because that's their favorite color. Oh my goodness. I should have never said that. Y'all think I'd know this man after all this time. Oh, he thinks it's so funny. <laughs> this kind of, don't you think this kind of looks like blue jeans, y'all? Did you just leave it like that? No, it's bugging me, though. <laughs> So, do y'all know of any good series or movies on Netflix or anything like that to watch? I'm running out of stuff to see. When there aren't any good lives on, you know? Or sometimes you just don't feel like watching it on. Feel like watching a movie. Steve doesn't like to watch movies with me, so I sit there and watch them by myself. I like to watch movies with anybody. Yeah, with anybody. I don't watch movies. He doesn't. I watch something that's either home improvement or cars or food. Or your family guy. Well, that's, that's duh. Everybody knows that. <laughs> I don't get into that family guy stuff. And you should hear them with Joshua, our son. They're like two peas in a pod. They both know every episode by heart. It's funny listening to the two of them talk. <laughs> so, Kim, did you make um, the wreath that you needed to make? With your, um, with your bikini booty girl. Bikini bottom. Yes. She makes the cutest wreath embellishments, y'all. Wreath decor by Kim. So when she says I can help, she'll help me with sewing. That's a that's a good thing. That's a real good thing. So no suggestions on what to watch. Do y'all not watch television very much? Television's getting so. Ugh. They showed um, the Dick Van Dyke show on in color the other night. So that was fun to watch. So now I know what color their sofa was. and <laughs> I like when they do that. Oh, they when they show, the yeah, they show the old episodes in color. They do that on I Love Lucy a lot at Christmas time. See, the second coat is the bomb. So this should go faster, y'all. Then, then I'll let this dry till tomorrow, and we will see how the decoupage comes up. Oh, are you working on several witches at once? I know, I can't believe it's already time to start working on fall stuff. Yeah, I got Kim some. Says not yet. I'm working on several witches at once. That's what I just. So you gotta make sure you keep these handy. Because they come in handy. Especially when you're a messy painter like I am. But I thought this would be cute on our door. Did you ever open your witch? No, I have not opened her yet. What are you waiting for? I don't know. Are you afraid it's going to scare you? I'm afraid she's going to scare me. No, she's so adorable. Oh, 
I'll open her tomorrow when we're while we're doing this decoupaging. I was supposed to open her on Thursday, but we didn't end up going live. We were out and about Thursday. Oh yeah, it's, what did we do Thursday? Thursday? We didn't get home till late Thursday. Oh, that was Friday. Well, that was later. Because I know we were supposed to go live on Thursday and didn't. We didn't get home till like I think the time we were gosh darn it, the time we were supposed to go live. I gotta let that dry. There we go. There we go. Yeah, that second coat is definitely needed. After I finish this E, I'll show you the last of the signs that we made. The time of July Yesterday. tomorrow. TBD? Yeah, to be determined, yes. It depends on how the day goes. I'll let you know, Kimmy. Kim, Kim, Kim. It's weird how some spots, I guess if they're not completely dry, they do that. It, it, it won't cover very well. It's weird. I'm figuring out this painting thing, y'all. I paint a little here and there, but... I seem to like it on rainy days. I don't know why. Don't know why. I'm even putting Steve to sleep. <laughs> So tomorrow will be the fun part where when we find out if the decoupage in the background works, right? That'll be fun. And don't forget these little snow cone dudes will be in the um in my boutique as well, y'all. There you go. And then you you know, I'll have lots of different colors for you to choose from. That's awesome. You can have your little snowmen holding them and, you know, your snowman wreaths. That's, that's awesome. Yeah. So if Kim makes snowmen, <laughs> we got something for them to hold. Right. Right? There you go. That's better than a snowman holding a snowman. Teamwork makes the dream work. Yeah. Now we just have the M and the E. I was going to say the W, but this is an M. <laughs> I forgot I was looking at it upside down. So do y'all like the color choices or what are you thinking? You won't hurt my feelings. Really good so far. I think so too. I gotta have. I like bright colors. I really like a lot of bright colors. If you know my wreaths and my centerpieces, you know that I like bright colors. I think it's a California thing. I'm just kidding. I don't know. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, we're almost done here, y'all. Hello, Kathy, how are you? We're just painting this sign that I got from um, Joann's. They had, it was on clearance for 70% off. So I figured I'd make it for our front door. Since, that sounds great idea. Since the, uh, since the birds are, well, at first they were stealing stuff out of my wreath to uh, build their nests. And then some hornets decided they wanted to keep building, the, or, I mean, wasps. There's Miss Joy. Hello, Joy, how are you? Yeah, those wasps, just like, wherever you want to put those nice out, they're like, oh, this is a good home. Yeah. They start building their little, whatever they're called. Yeah, their little, little colony thing, whatever. Yeah, so like so we're just doing a little painting this Science afternoon. This gloomy, gloomy, gloomy afternoon. Norfolk afternoon. <sighs> we're gonna paint this, and then I'm gonna tomorrow. I'm gonna use this um this little gingham napkin as the background. We're gonna try to decoupage or something, something to it. We'll see. <laughs> I think it'll be awesome. You know how it goes with Willie. Winging it, winging it. I think it'll be fabulous. Fabulous, darling. Yeah, if y'all get a chance, I'll uh, check out that Halston. It was good. It was kind of interesting. Kind of a little bit racy here and there, but and a lot of potty mouth. Yeah, a lot of cuss words. That's the only thing I didn't like, but you figure that was true, you know, to what was going on and, and the era and everything, so. <clears throat> but it was nice to see how he made his, his way up, because he was fighting, you know, Calvin Klein and um, Yves Saint Laurent and all those big names trying to get in there. You know. Makes the wreath making industry seem a little trivial. <laughs> but you know, it's it's our everybody's struggles, you know. That was cool. It was a good little series. It was, you know, just long enough. I don't know, probably like five or six. Um, there we go. That one spot is going to bug me for a hot minute, but <laughs> hello, Jana. How are you? Yeah, see, this, they're still too wet to go back over again because otherwise it's just going to take off what I've put on there. Right. You don't want that to happen. No. Is that what we're talking about in the M? That spot right there. The bottom in the, in the middle of the M. Yeah. The right yeah. That's all right. Yeah. I'm going to go over this color just one more time. That's the I really thing. like these bright colors, though. Oh, I don't have patience when it comes to wetting. I can't try either because they let it dry at least an hour or so before you go back over it. Yeah. Well, that's what this, it'll just do what you're doing. It'll just smear. Yeah. But this, well, this one had a chance to dry. So, so. If, it was, if it was a nicer day, we could put it outside in the sun. So right. And I don't even have room for my, well, I have a blow dryer right behind me, but no outlet right close or anything. So. You can put it on top of the washing machine because the fan's out there. It'll, cool, it'll help it dry faster. Well, I turned the fan off because it's cold. Oh, okay. I need the fan on. But that's no big deal. I'll just uh, let it dry in here overnight. Do any touch ups I need to, and then tomorrow sometime we'll. Part two? Yes! Oh, I said I was gonna show the last couple signs. <laughs> I fibbed, didn't I? Oh my goodness. I just wanna finish up these bottom petals, I promise. There's a couple of naked spots that were driving me crazy. Okay. Thanks, Joy. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna do this on the background, so I think that'll look fun, won't it? Yeah. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna, you know, over the evening. I'm gonna go over the edges because that's 
Y'all will see nothing but the top of my big old head, so we don't need all that. Look at this one. This one is so cute. And this is a 6x12. How cute is that? Now, this one's not listed yet either, so. I know. That's what I'll be doing after the live. I took pictures before the live, but isn't that adorable? I love that little, uh, I don't know. It kind of reminds me like of Holly Hobby sort of stuff. Not Holly Hobby. What's it called? Those precious moments. That's what it is. The precious oh, moments. Precious. My precious. Yep, I'm in the Christmas mood, y'all. I don't know. This weather makes me in the Christmas mood. Look at this. Happy holidays. Isn't that cute? Yeah. Power washing the porch. I like power washing. Steve loves power washing. Next Saturday, we're, we're doing um, cleaning day at the church. And uh, Steve is our power washing boy. <laughs> He's, we're going to be power washing the church. No, not yet. Well, you guys will talk about it tonight, I guess. And then we have this one. And this, of course, is the eight inch round, and it's. Um... I'll catch you on a couple of signs. Okay. Here. That's cool, Joy. It's kind of an uphill walking. Is it? Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and we'll also. Um, the edge of it is looks like wood, you know? It looks like a. Like a, a stump or something, yeah. So, but the, and then we'll have it in the red and black plaid too. It's also um, looks like it's yeah. Yeah, if you well, when, once you see the pictures, you know, in the in my Etsy shop, you'll see them. You'll see what that it looks like wood around the the edge, the border of it. So, y'all, this is all I'm gonna do today. Um, I gotta let this dry before I do another coat and do the edges and all that. And then tomorrow at some point we will um, do this. I wanna do this on the background. I think that'll look really cute. Okay? And who knows, maybe I'll show you how I make my guacamole. Oh, surprise. <laughs> maybe, <laughs> we'll see how that goes. Okay, y'all, well enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks for spending a little time with us. I hope you had a good time. I hope we didn't bore you too much, but I thought it was fun. <laughs> um, have a blessed afternoon, and we'll see you tomorrow. All righty, take care.